Hi folks, Robert Quigley here, Washington DC, the Money Pit Group. This video is going to be about an independence political philosophy. We all know what a Republican is, essentially winner take all type of philosophy. We all know what a Democrat is, oh my gosh, cradle to grave. Uh, uh, government uh, uh, support and control. Uh, this is not an independent. Uh, as, as independents, we're not socialist, we're not communist, we're not fascist, we're not rightist, we're not leftist. We are first and foremost pragmatist. What does that mean? Most problems in life can be solved with pragmatic so solutions, not philosophies. As the political season kicks off, we're in the 2022 midterms, and as soon as those are over, the 2024 presidential uh, uh, election will, will, will ramp up. We will begin to be bombarded by one advertisement after another. But we're in for the, the, the list of following things that are about to uh, that I'm about to talk about. We're going to get more than a a, a a sickening dose of identity politics. It's coming, guys, but it leads to our demise. Same with group politics. Oh my gosh, it's coming our way like a freight train barreling down a train track. It leads to demise. Politics of lies. Oh my gosh, we've all been there. We've all heard it. That just leads to demise. We're going to have politics of half measures, fake solutions, and corruption. Oh my gosh, all of this leads to demise. Independents are for shrinking the state. Simple as that. In my administration, government is not going to provide 4,000 jobs for our closest supporters. That's not the focus of an independent. That's not the focus of an independent administration. Now, my administration is going to provide uh, jobs for 4,000 of America's very best entrepreneurs, which, as you can immediately surmise, they don't, they're not going to need those jobs but they are going to bring their skills and expertise and life experience to the Quigley administration and to the upper echelons of the federal government because they're problem solvers. And together, we're going to refocus the American government's attention on solving big problems. Government as a gatekeeper does not work. Government as a no machine does not work. Oh my gosh, the endless government lines, uh, the, 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 uh, the, the letters and the emails and the requests for help that, that, go, that languish for, for hours, days, weeks, and months and never get answered. All that stuff is, is, is gone. Uh, government is going to be focused on solving problems. Uh, let me just give you an example. Uh, we're never going to pass a piece of legislation that's, that's designed uh, explicitly or implicitly to help our friends that that's not what government is about government is about solving the very big problems in society and and first and foremost helping every person in society become a self provider if i can't read a bill in one day i'm not going to sign a bill it's as simple as that uh, now, if you want to know about my academic background, you can go back to the video entitled uh, uh, a Channel Introduction. Uh, I can read. There's no question about it. Uh, but the issue is, does it make sense to, uh, to, to sign a bill that, that no one single person has actually read through and understands from beginning to end? Well, the answer is obviously no. But this goes on all the time in, in the American government. So, so I'm just putting that out there as just a flavor of what an independent administration is going to look like. If I see bills on my desk, I better be able to uh, comfortably read that in one day because if I can, it's not getting passed. It's as simple as that. Our motto is going to be, we are problem solvers solving problems. That's it in a nutshell. 
Well, ho well folks, I hope that gives you a flavor of what an independent uh, political party or an independent administration in the White House is going to look like. Uh, we're pragmatists. We're, we're not philosophers. We can talk philosophy all day and all night if you like, but, but that's not solving problems. We are pragmatic people. So if, if this is something that sounds familiar, if this is something that uh, uh, lands close to home and you want to be part of the cause, I implore you to push the subscribe button, uh, join the team, add your comments below, let us know where I'm right, uh, let me know where I'm wrong. Uh, you're welcome aboard. Until we meet again.